Yeah, these every bone in his body is crushed completely. Are I'm just gonna lay here. I mean, I'm hitting all the buttons. He's not going anywhere. I'm pushing all the buttons and nothing's happening. That horseman's gonna eat him if I keep playing. <laughs> uh, way to make a statement, Shovel Knight. <laughs> Ballistics physics. Ballistic physics. There is a way to um, avoid that animation, actually. Avoid the animation? Yeah, avoid the animation of just, like, you know, breaking every bone in your body. Well, it sounds like something you want to avoid. <laughs> <laughs> if you get the gold armor, you don't have that animation. You just kind of land daintily in pose. Oh, uh, so it's not is... useless after all. Yeah. Is that the entire point to the fancy That is armor? the entire point of the gold armor. Yeah, I'm alright with that. It's perfect. This is a neat little mini stage. Yeah, it's acclimating you to the uses of uh, the duster knuckles. And it's Shelf Knight saying, We're Metroid Mania 2, Vania. What? Metroid Vania. You know where you have a stage, but you need a thing, but you may not have that thing uh, yeah, yet. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. I wasn't sure how you were. Because when I think of Metroid Vania, I think huge maps that you can just, like, get lost in. Mm hmm. What, what, what do you call it when there's items to get to get places that you won't get? What, what kind of Vania is that? What, Zelda logic? Zelda logic, huh? Zelda logic Vania? Yeah. Alright. I mean, it is te that is technically Metroidvania logic, but I typically just... When people say Metroidvania, I think, oh, this place is going to have a huge map I could explore. Mm. That's fair. That is fair. Alright, this one's kind of... How does this make any sense? The bubble, or or everything. Yeah, how, does the, how does the bubble emerge from lava? <laughs> it's a fair question. It's the, I think there's a dragon farting in the lava. So the, so. <laughs> Tell me your secrets, lava. Guacamole. Yeah, guacamole is so weird. I remember like so initially good. being. Yeah, it's great, but like I remember my initial scorn when I first saw the city, and there was there were just like memes everywhere, and I'm just sitting there like, ugh, what? And they shut off the game. It does have a lot of memes. Then I actually played the game and realized it's really fucking good. Damn right. <laughs> Let's see. Unless you try to go for the true end, then you want to kill yourself with how hard it is. <laughs> ugh. Let's see. I. I think, I think what we'll do is do these two little sub things, and then I think we'll be done for now. Alright. Alright. Iga said he wasn't actually thinking of Metroid at all when he made Symphony of the Night and was inspired more by Zelda games. See, that kind of makes sense to me. Hmm. You know, I still have never played Symphony of the Night. I would play it. It's pretty good. Yeah, I would say it's pretty like good. I played I think... for the first time I think a year ago. Still like, still holds great. up. Yeah, easily holds up except for one little thing. Hmm. Is it Have that there's played... no actual symphony in the game? Well, that and mm -hmm. some of the voice acting is just Grr. It's superb. It's perfect. Doesn't that have some classic voice acting lines from it? Yeah. <laughs> I mean. The traditional line still holds up, but like when you actually like when they actually try to be a story, I'm just like, no, stop. <laughs> well, I think that kind of applies to Castlevania as a series. <laughs> um, okay, yeah. <laughs> still playing it safe. Still the dumbest thing ever. You were defeated the moment you forgot how to love. <laughs> That's a line. That is a line. <laughs> it's so true. Symphony Night is so, like, Japanese when it comes to the dialogue. Like, have you seen a SGDQ when they always, always, always act out the intro to that game? Yes, yeah, I have not seen it. Whoops, okay. That... It's a sight to behold, nerds trying to voice act. <laughs> Are you saying they don't do a good job at voice acting? Nah, I can't possibly be in sarcastic at... I can't Are possibly be sarcastic down the gauntlet right now? <laughs> A shortcut. Shortcut? But yeah, if you shortcut? Wanna, like, 
I forget where the shortcut. Oh, just back here. Hello, Bard. <laughs> Two lives lost. Why would you dance about that? <laughs> Yay! My good friend's here. I'm gonna go rob his corpse now. Woohoo! <laughs> but yeah, if you haven't done so, and if you like streaming something blind and having fun with it, I would definitely recommend Symphony of Night. <clears throat> Don't know what version to recommend though, because I um acquired the PSX version and it didn't run too well. Hmm. Dexalon's pitched some uh, PSX emulators to me, and I've yeah I've rebuffed his advances every single time. <laughs> Well, good for you. Keep your individuality. A, that's right. I'm a purist. I play video games on their console. That's right. Um. Hmm. Oh, so it's five grand just to unlock the uh, covenant or the. Uh, yeah, the covenant oh, of. Uh, <laughs> sorry, my mind is somewhere else for some reason. <laughs> the Hall of Champions. Is Dark Souls. <laughs> Yeah, that's like one weird thing that bugs me about this game. Every like reviewer compares it to Dark Souls, and I just sit there like, no, it's not at all. Well, the only thing I could draw it to is the losing your money and being able to yeah. get it back. That's actually a good game mechanic, but that doesn't make the entire game Dark Souls. You're right, right. Or does it? <sighs> so if I pay once, can I come back anytime? Well. The thing is, once you go in, there's no going back. Oh. But it's actually a relatively uh, simple dungeon. I'll save that for a future stream. Alright. The art is not for one as peasant as you. Oh. <laughs> I'm a peacock. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. It's weird. I mean, you can speak English really well for a peacock, though. It's a condition, you see. Alright. Everybody's trying to rip Shovel Knight off for his money. <laughs> Black Knight or White Knight? <laughs> right, guys? Anyone? Is it, just, make this joke? is it just me or what? Every time the letters shake, I just imagine their voices cracking when they yell. <laughs> like the nerd guy on The Simpsons? Yes. Ah! I do gotta say, the uh, Black Knight fights are really good in this game. Yeah. Like, the developers clearly understood that this is supposed to be... Like, rival fights are supposed to be just fighting yourself, so... <clears throat> you knew exactly what to do. And you're gonna... You're gonna coin this dude to death? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't quite work. Or did it? Oh yeah, he could reflect your own bullets too. Wow. Didn't even realize that. Yeah, Chaos Orb. Kind of overpowered. Yeah, I hardly used it in my first playthrough. It's good because it has, like, infinite penetration, so if you, like, hit a dude in the corner, you Hi, can wait, get... this is a G-rated stream. Sorry! Jeez. He's a peacock, he doesn't know any better. <laughs> yes. Peasants <laughs> such as yourself wouldn't understand my complicated dialect. Doing much better than I did the first time fighting this guy. Yeah. It's the power of the orb. Definitely. <laughs> Anybody remember those, um... Out of power. Those, uh... TV ads where they would, like, advertise these zen orbs that you would just, like, rotate in your hand and it would, like... Fuck, I forget what they're called. Zen orbs? Um, yeah, it was really weird. Are you talking about healing crystals or something? No, it was, like, a, just a plastic orb that you spend 30 bucks for. Sold. Oh, no. No, that's... <laughs> I know plenty of people who use this. You've got to channel your chi somehow. Mm. I, I guess. All right. Well, I think that's going to do it for this stream. Got three more stages left. Hopefully knock those out next time. And then right. the end of the game is beyond that. Yep. Cool. See, oh, the frigid flight. I need something I don't have yet, right? Yeah, you need the, uh, you need the uh, sky button. That's right. That's right. Well, Mr. Wang, Mr. Direction, 
thanks so much for chilling and hanging yeah, out. Thanks for having us. On. Yeah. And I guess we'll see you guys again next time. Later, oh, cool. Later, Gators.